when I'm designing a board, no matter what it is, if I was just going to get given a board to, say, take this flavor and make it asymmetric, I'll, depending on the, on the design, but usually it's the longer rail on the toe side, because I think you can go out into the flats and you have advantage and the leverage of your feet to get out there further and nurse it higher. So I'll generally take a toe side of a board and pretty much leave it the same because that really is a good reference for what the flavor of the board is. So I leave the toe side the same. Um, I do incorporate a twisted rocker which probably isn't worth explaining but that's in there. And um, the heel side I will fill up the rail for two reasons. I think you're heavier on your heel side so I want the board to sink a little bit later but I also want it more forgiving so if I have a fuller rail this is a heel side here if I have a fuller ping pong ball rail there compared to this still slightly smaller ping pong but down rail I'll have more sensitivity on the down rail to surf more accurately but when I go into my heels or when I'm weaving on my heel side line I'm going to dig rail less if I dig rail less I'll connect the dots more surf better yeah. So I think that one of the biggest changes in your small wave board is if you, especially backside, if you don't, if you're not digging rail as much, right? Then you're gonna love it. Yeah. So, longer rail on the toes, fuller rail on the heel with a shorter outline. So one, two, see the difference in the point there. And I've changed the heel side and get rid of this real estate over here because if you're standing up and you come onto your heels, if there's no board right here in this quadrant. You're gonna come around sooner. Yeah. Now with that extra weight from the how your body's working, you got more weight to add into that. So you may as well have the board come around, and then when you go back to your toes, you have the time to nurse it in and out, and you know, clutch, 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 clutch. clutch. Oh, and and moving the center reference over one's ankle. So if I had a board with a stringer in, move that stringer over the ankle. If it's a thruster, that pivotal thruster fin over the ankle. If it's a single fin, over the ankle. If it's a twin move the real estate so that it's pivotal reference if it's a V bottom whatever the center part of that design is get rid of the center put it over the ankle and um, centered over ankle rather than over foot absolutely yeah. so who cares where the stringer is the wave yeah. doesn't right let's care where the ankle is yeah.